Welcome back, Brick Builders, and today we will be taking a look at the Hungarian Dragon Light Kit from Light My Bricks. This is a way to keep your bricks from sitting in the dark. You know, when they're sitting in the wall behind you, you don't want to have them just hidden. Even with a shelf light, they're still hidden. So, lighting it up is the best way to go. Let's take a look at everything you will get with Light My Breaks Hungarian Dragon Light Kit. Once you get the box and you open the box and you look inside, you will get six assorted bit lights, one effect board, one expansion board, some connecting cables, four adhesive squares, 14 assorted bricks, and one USB power cable. And as you can see, these bags are empty. That's because the set is already lit. Here is the Hungarian dragon from the Harry Potter set, lit in its glory, but not lit for the dark. I do want to make a disclaimer that this set in the light kit was all built live on twitch.tv slash Fluffy's Brick Studio. So if you're interested in watching sets built live before reviews and light kits installed, definitely follow twitch.tv slash Fluffy Brick Studio for all the details. All right, it is time to light it. In three, two, one. Here we have the Hungarian Dragon fully lit and actually lit for the dark. So we're gonna talk about some key points of this light kit and what it has to offer. Let's start with what you see in the front. Right off the bat, you see that there is the flickering board here and for the flame up top. So what you have here is it's flickering for the flame that on Harry Potter during the movie when Harry's on his broomstick and it's on fire because the Hungarian dragon caught the broomstick on fire. So it's doing a fire effect as if it was on fire. Note, this is part of the extra pieces you're gonna get because in the actual build, you will not have that. Also, when it comes to the egg, they give you an extra piece so you can lift the egg more off to fit the wire kit in. As you can see, the egg is nicely lit. I'm gonna try to close these off so you can see a little more. If you can see that little egg nice and lit down there. But why it's so bright is you make two homemade Light My Brick style spotlights. This is one thing Light My Brick does real well. It takes literally three Lego pieces and a white bit light to make a nice spotlight, which makes it look absolutely phenomenal from the front angle. So it glows under the wings. You might see a little bit of wiring right here, but nothing that Harry's not blocking if you're not really looking. They try very detailedly hard to try to hide as much wire as possible, but you can only hide as much wire in any way without destroying the wire. So you have the flame up top nice and lit. You have the flickering effect from the board on Harry's broomstick. Then you have the two spotlights here. The egg is lit on the bottom as if it's nice and warm. And when you come to the back, you have another bright spotlight to light up the back of the feet, some of the tail, and all of this, don't worry, some might ask, can you still flap your wings with this light kit? And that is a definitely a yes. Let's see if I can get a nice front angle for you. We're gonna flap those wings. Doesn't it just look so realistic and magnificent and those amazing lights? Now the Hungarian dragon will no longer be hidden in the dark because of the light. Game. So now that you've seen it lit up, you've seen the set before it was lit up. What is your thoughts? Do you think it's worth it? Me, as a light my brick enthusiast that I loves to light displayable sets, it's always worth it to me. But if you're not one of those people that need to light everything, let me know your thoughts in the comments because I, I, I'm interested in hearing. Also, let me know if there's features of it that you wish were a little different. But I really like what Light Might Brick does. 
they're my always go-to. Hungarian Dragon was my first set I actually lit. I have a couple other sets lit and gonna be lit. And I'll begin to those reviews very shortly. If you are interested in seeing more light kits being reviewed, more kits being reviewed as in sets, on this channel we're truly trying to look to move towards, you know, displayable sets, not playable sets, and we're also trying to light every one of them as possible. So if that's something you're interested in, please consider liking this video, subscribing. And if you also want to hang out as a community and talk more about LEGO or light kits, definitely consider going down to the description and clicking the link to this board where you can hang out with a lot, a, a lot of other LEGO enthusiasts and brick light enthusiasts talking all about LEGO and lights. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I th hope this video was as helpful. I know this set is actually going to be fading away soon, sadly. So, get the kit and get the set as soon as possible. And always remember, keep building your life one brick at a time and never let your set sit in the dark.